Well, this is my last day in Milwaukee. I had a fantastic time. But before I drive to the airport and fly back to my home city of Toronto, I thought I would try two more restaurants that I heard so much about. Cousin Subs smells so, so good. And Cops Frozen Custard. Big bucks, but look at all the pecans they put on top. Cherry, you gotta eat the cherry first. Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. I am still in Milwaukee. I have two more places that I need to try. One of them is called Cousins Subs. Don't know anything about it, but I've heard really good things about Cousins. And uh, I'm gonna go in there, find the sub that I think that I'm gonna like, bring it back here, eat it with you. After that, we're gonna go over to Cops Frozen Custard. There are three locations, one on the north, one on the west, one on the south. I am in the south. Uh, area and uh, apparently they have the best frozen custard on the planet so uh, we will do that for dessert but first let's go into Cousin Subs and grab a sub. Thanks guys. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back in the car. So the club sub here at Cousins uh, starts with your Italian bread and they put mayo, lettuce, provolone, ham, turkey, onions, tomatoes, and oregano. And it comes to a total of $6.67. And I got my Coke still from yesterday. It's still good. We'll continue on with that. Don't want to waste it. I'll put a little sticker on there. Cousins. I totally forgot my uh, steering wheel tray. That sucks. It fits in my luggage, so I'll bring it next time. Ooh. So there is your beautiful Italian bread. The ends cut off. I'm not sure why they do that, but uh, maybe it's just the style of sub that they do. Maybe this is a half. Maybe it is supposed to be this long. It does have the, the, the little slash on there, half, but I didn't ask for a half. I'm glad they only gave me this, because that's to me, that's a foot long, yeah, that's a foot long sub. Oh, it smells so, so good. Oh yeah, the onions and the oregano are gonna make this sub a wonderful thing. Mmm. It's all about the uh, the bun that makes or breaks a sub. There's a lot of cornmeal on this. It's all coming down. I've destroyed this rental car for sure. I'm not sure if the oregano is part of a dressing, like a vinaigrette, because it tastes like the vinaigrette. It's probably the onions and the oregano uh, that are mixing together that are giving it that amazing sub flair to it. And there's your provolone. Three strips of prov provolone. That's gonna hit the spot for sure. Let me know in the comments below if you agree or disagree if that is the perfect amount of meat and to cheese ratio. Uh, one of the things that's kind of bugs me is when they don't cut it all the way through, they open it up like a book, put all the stuff in it, and then they fold it. But as you eat it, it all starts gushing out the one side. I prefer them just to cut it. Just cut it. Just cut like a sandwich, please. Other than that, it's great. I can totally see why this is probably their number one sub that they sell at uh, Cousins. It's fantastic. Mmm. So good. All right, guys, all done. That was fabulous. On my rating scale, I'm going to have to give Cousins subs club sub a go out and get it now it was fantastic from that amazing italian bread all the way down to all the ingredients uh it was wonderful now it's time to drive over to cops and see how their frozen custard tastes all 
All right, made it safely over to Cops. It literally is across the street from Cousin Subs. Let's go in there and grab some frozen custard and see if it is good as people say it is. Banana split, fudge delight. I think I'm gonna have to do that. So much stuff, so little time. I think I'm gonna have to go with fudge delight. Thank you. Thank you. I had to wait. It's kind of cool. This place it looks like a factory. It's all stainless steel. So it looks like this side is cones and soft drinks only. And then in the middle it says pick up on color. I guess that's where you get your toppings and stuff. And at the far end is a uh, place like things like this. Big Sundays and banana splits. Thank you very much. It looks great. Wow. Check that out, people. Woo, let's go eat. We are back in the car with this fudge sundae, fudge delight, and it was seven dollars and sixteen cents. Wow, big bucks! Big bucks. But look at all the pecans they put on top. Cherry, you gotta eat the cherry first. Oh, la la. Oh, let's just do that first. I think I was told the difference between ice cream and the frozen custard is they put eggs in it. Correct me if I'm wrong, I've never known what frozen custard really is but uh it looks good how thick that is Ooh la la mm. the uh, pecans are um coated in sugar so every bite is a super sweet of course a cherry i love cherries mm. another bite mm. so cold that's probably 800 to a thousand calories do you agree or disagree <laughs> leave a comment in the comment section below i'm trying to get just to the custard and i think this is possibly it it's mainly custard mm. it is so much smoother than ice cream it's super rich super thick super creamy just an amazing little dessert unfortunately you can't have that every day the fudge is very thick, very rich, very chocolatey. This is wonderful. Uh, if you live anywhere in Wisconsin, I'm sure you probably had Cops cu frozen custard. But if you're ever visiting Wisconsin and you're gonna be near um, Milwaukee, definitely drop by a uh, Cops. I I'm, I'm guessing second best would be Culver's. You guys can fight about it in the comment section below. Who's better, Cops? or uh, Culver's for their ice, for their uh, frozen custard. I'm thinking it's cops. I'm just trying to eat up all the pecans, get them out of the way. Uh-oh. But I've eaten up all the pecans and most of the chocolate on the top. So now we're gonna get just frozen custard because that, that's what, all I want to try. Mmm. Yeah, it is probably one of the best frozen custards you'd ever have. It's just like ice cream, but it's a little more rich and uh, creamy tasting. That is phenomenal, people. Go out and get it now. Next time I come to Milwaukee, I'll have to come back here, try some uh, food reviews of their food, and I'll also get another one of these maybe. All right, guys, I am done. The frozen custard fudge delight on my rating scale, Cops gets a go out and get it now. Plus, that is a brilliant, brilliant frozen custard concoction. And the fact that there was fudge, pecans, and a cherry on top, two thumbs up. 
All right, guys, if you love these videos and you want to show your support for me doing these videos just for you, hit it with a thumbs up, ding, 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 ding. But if you're still hungry, check out this playlist and I'll see you over there.